Authorities in Australia are doing their best to convince the youth to avoid smoking marijuana. Now, of course, uh, smoking marijuana is illegal in Australia. However, these videos that have gone viral don't necessarily convince kids that it's a bad idea to light up. Take a look. Okay, time's up. Pens down. Delilah. Pens down, Delilah. Mm. Sloth. Jason, could you pass the salt, please, darling? Jason, the salt. What do you think, Dave? that enough. I'm I just know. trying to figure out which part of the grunting I like better. The oh. Oh, or at the end when the stoner sloth is filled with shame and goes, oh. Oh. <laughs> um, sloths are the cutest animals ever. I love sloths, so I'm already inclined to love these um, ads. And the reason why they went viral is because kids thought that it was a joke. Now this is a government program in Australia aimed at convincing kids to not smoke weed, but I think it's doing the opposite. First of all, look, if you are an official who's really concerned about teenagers smoking weed, I get it, I get it. I don't want teenagers smoking weed either. I want them to be adults before they smoke weed, okay? Their brains are still developing, it's not a good idea. You guys get the point. However, you need to understand what marijuana actually legitimately does. That way you have an educated, well-rounded, comprehensive campaign that is factual. When you put out these like fear-mongering ads, which by the way, their attempt at fear-mongering even failed, it doesn't work. Marijuana doesn't make you so incapacitated that you don't know the difference between a salad and salt. It just doesn't work that way, right? So already kids are gonna, no, it doesn't work that way. <laughs> even if you're smoking like the strongest indica imaginable, it, you're not incapacitated. Oh, I like that dropping some knowledge there on the indica. Okay. Right? Like, okay. like educate yourself before you put this campaign together because if you put out like laughable garbage like this, kids aren't gonna buy into it. Well, look, I know a friend is very forgetful when he lights up. Uh -huh. So like, oh, I was gonna say, mm -hmm. wait. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is salt? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the part where the parents get pissed, I, I'd be pissed uh -huh. as a parent. The, where, the part where the teacher is disappointed, I get that. The part where the kids are like, stoner sloth. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> Nobody, kids don't talk that way. They're not going to say that. That's uh, they, they, I, they probably thought it'll catch on. We'll get to sh the yep. our, the kids will shame the other kids for us by going around going stoner sloth. <laughs> I don't think even me girls would do that. One of the guys on Facebook, Richard Knight. Everybody on Facebook is wondering like, wait, is it real? It's so preposterous yes. that they couldn't figure out if it was real or not. And then the, the Australian government had to put out a statement saying. Yeah. Yeah, uh, our bad. It's it's real. <laughs> okay, Richard Knight on Facebook says he he found it unreasonably funny. <laughs> <laughs> I love that turn of phrase. <laughs> it was unreasonably funny. Um, so it's amazing. And, and by the way, uh, the there are they have decriminalized for minor offenses in South Australia, Northern Territory, and the Australian Capital Territory, uh, but overall uh, still. Uh, 
illegal. I don't mind doing education campaigns. I, if you decriminalize all over yeah. and you make it legal and then you want to do an education campaign, hey, don't do it while taking a test. Duh. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Okay. Mm. I don't mind the education campaigns. It's just, just this hap this one happens to be unreasonably funny. Right. That's all. It is unreasonably funny, but again, it's just not factual. Just be honest with them, right? Be honest about what marijuana does. Look, I I can't smoke marijuana before coming into work or before doing anything like important, right? Because mm -hmm. it does slow you down, but it doesn't slow you down to the point where you can't function at all. It just makes me want to relax, you know? And so be honest with them. Explain to them how it'll it'll make you a little less motivated to get your job done or your chores done. Although sometimes on Sundays, like if I need to clean, it's like the best way to do it. Really? It helps like it makes the cleaning process a lot easier and a little bit fun. Yeah. Try no, it. You know, look, I I disagree with you this a is little the bit opposite on of what the, the government wants to do by the way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I disagree with you a little bit on the effects. Uh I, you know, my friend has had some sloth like tendencies when he's on it. Like, yeah. there'll be moments where the, he will be frozen <laughs> and go, um, and then go, I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, it, so it, it, everybody has a different reaction to it. Mm -hmm. But making like a fun mascot out of it was not the right way to go. Agreed. <laughs> Agreed. All right. And who next time they get high and are with somebody is not going to call them a stoner sloth and mean it as a compliment. I know. <laughs> look at how cute that sloth is. They always look like they're smiling.